How do you detect the sturgeon bite? And when do you set the hook? Hi, Paul from Anchor Caddy. In the last episodes, we got you up to this point. If you missed any of those episodes or want to watch those episodes, go to the Anchor Caddy YouTube channel and you can watch those or you can click on the link here. In this episode, we're going to show you actual footage of the bite. We're also going to include some underwater footage of sturgeon behavior. Compliments of Alan Best at Northwest Marine Solutions. Thanks, Alan. So let's get started. Here you see small taps on the line. This is not the time to set the hook. If you do, it'll likely be a swing and a miss. As you can see, sturgeon can be very apprehensive. In this case, it's just investigating it, which will lead to periodic taps on your rod tip. As you can see, if you tried to set the hook now, you'd come up with nothing. Barring an obvious takedown of your rod, if you see something like this, you can feel comfortable setting the hook, or letting some line out to see if he runs with it, then set the hook. Well, that concludes our series on how to catch sturgeon from a boat. I hope you enjoyed it, and thanks for watching. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel or go to anchorcaddy.com for more information and all your anchoring needs.